my name is Tony Solis and I am Miss Week's Weekly Witness. Uh, Dominic asked me to say a few words about how I see God in my daily life. And after sitting down and thinking about it um, quite a bit, I would say that it's a two-part answer for me. Um, I see God daily in my family, in my wife Lindsay and my daughter Olivia, uh, and the obvious blessings there that I have with them. Um, at times I don't feel worthy of, of just how great my family is. Um, and then I would say forgiveness, God's forgiveness is great. Um, I was away from the Catholic Church for uh, many years before I came back. Um, I was born and raised Catholic. I don't think I ever really understood my faith despite uh, a Catholic education, um, almost 12 years of, of Catholic schooling, but I don't think I ever really understood it. Um, and I, when I drifted away from my faith and my religion, I drifted pretty far away. Um, and, and as the, you know, the further away I got, um, the more difficult I find it, I found it to come back. Um, I found myself making excuses um, and obviously, you know, the more, the more time passed, uh, the more excuses I came up with as to why I, I, I didn't, I didn't want to come back. And one day, um, I decided to walk into St. Michael's Parish, um, on a Sunday. I decided to go back to Mass. Um, I feel like Father Dealey's, um, homily that day spoke directly to me. It was almost like his, his you know, um, his homily was geared right toward me sitting in the, in, in the pew. Um, and he was talking about God's forgiveness. He was talking about confession. Um, shortly thereafter, I went to confession um, and I found that um, I, I had such a burden lifted off my shoulders. Um, I've been going ever since. Um, I've, you know, more so through COVID and every, COVID-19 and everything, um, have been uh, reading the Bible daily. Um, I've also been reading the Catholic Catechism. So, um, you know, really getting into, really getting into my faith, not just understanding it, but m more or less studying it. Um, but I would say on a daily basis, the things that I see God in, you know, going back to the forgiveness, God forgives us and wants us to be present. Um, I think, we need, if we drift away, to understand that we can go right back. Um, we don't have to wait. We don't have to make excuses. Um, he forgives us, and, and, and we just need to take the leap um, and pick, pick right back up uh, where we left off. None of us are without sin, certainly. Um, and so I, th I think that's where I... Where I, where I feel like I see, you know, God daily. Um, I know that I'm not gonna be perfect, but I know that I might, with his help, be better tomorrow than I was today. Recognize where my strengths and my weaknesses are. Um, ask him for thanks for my strengths and for assistance with my weaknesses. Um, I like to pray the rosary uh, each day before my family gets up. Uh, sometimes I don't get there. Um, at that time, but I, I try to, I try to carve out, um, 15, 20 minutes to do that a day because I feel like it centers me. I feel like I'm a little less angry in traffic, <laughs> um, not to make light of it, but, but it, it definitely, it, that's one of the things that definitely helps me on a daily basis. Um, and obviously, um, script, scripture, um, I definitely enjoy reading scripture daily. Uh, I miss it. Um, when I don't get to it, when my day has been busy and I can't get, get to the scripture, I definitely miss it. Um, and I would say that's, that's pretty much, that's pretty much it. Um, I have been going to men's prayer group, um, at St. Michael's on Sunday night. Uh, I like to touch base with, um, Christian men, um, with, who are like-minded, um, and, and, and sort of recenter myself before I head back into the work week. I get a lot of enjoyment and fulfillment from that. So I would also say that, that I see him working in, in me in, in, in that. But um, 
That's about it. Happy Veterans Day and happy birthday to the Marine Corps. And um, see you all at church.